what up cut ups today's video might affect some people as well as should because when you speak the truth a lot of times people don't like that they don't want to hear that a lot of people cannot handle that and I have a couple stories to tell little stories but very significant when it comes to people thinking that I'm dumb. Like, to do that, to think that would be just stupid. I mean, really can't pick another word for that. But if you think I'm dumb, baby, it just makes you stupid tenfold. So, and I say all that because a lot of stuff has went on uh, lately, guys. Family, relationships, issues. Um, it's just a lot going on in my family right now. And I'm going to say this. If you feel like you have any type of with or think it's any type of a competition as far as brain power um y'all should already know don't do it because y'all already know there's no comparison like i don't even need to get into detail i don't even need to do that okay uh dumb never that nothing about me dumb whenever you think you can put something over on me think again and then think again, okay? Because it can't be done, not here, okay? I don't just have street sense and street smarts, okay? Got common sense too, and a lot of intelligence. So I just mix mine all up and, and wellow in it, wallow in it, whatever you want to call it, but I own it, okay? And I would never allow somebody that is really very dumb, okay, to ever think that they can get into my brain to make me think that. Motherfucker, please, please, please. Y'all know better, okay? And, y'all, <laughs> I got a whole nother story to tell. I, right now, I'm trying to stick with this one, but I just want to show y'all something. And, um, that's why a uh, secret sabotage is in the title of this video. And I say this because the first wig that I ever had. Now, this person going to have to get called out because there's only one person that did this shit. Okay. The first wig that I ever had was the one I wore on my birthday. Okay. Straight. Well, it wasn't straight. It was supposed to be um, body weight. Here, okay. Let me show y'all. I didn't comb this thing out though today, y'all. But this is it. This is the wig right here, okay. The one I wore for my birthday. This is it, okay. Now, what I'm about to show y'all is the reason why I say this is a secret sabotage. And I say that because, as you all know, um, for my birthday, I went to Chicago and partied there or whatever. And my sister Kiki from Atlanta came to join me, you know, in all of this. Kiki kept telling me how cute my hair was. Kept telling me how cute this wig was cute. She liked it. Okay. Um, asked me for the link where I got it from. I gave it to her. Nothing to hide. Still not going to make you look like me. Uh, whether you get the same wig or not. <laughs> At any rate. She kept saying how pretty this wig was, y'all. Okay. Ordered the same one. Same exact one. Now, this is the part I don't understand. And y'all know I'm new to the wig game. Okay. See, please don't make a mistake 
and judging a person when they're just naive about something and think that they're just dumb um, intellectually. Please, don't do that. If a person don't know something, they, they just don't know, okay? I'm the type of person I learn pretty quick, though. And y'all know I'm new to the wig game, okay? But I'm learning, and I'm learning real quick. And all I know is that all of the wigs that I have ordered, y'all, including this one, they have came like this. They come pretty much in place. I'm not talking about, let me try to be, let me try to be specific. What I'm about to say is this. When I bought my wigs, all of them, or anything, not even hair, just anything, if you can see that it's defected, most people are going to send it back or get their money back or something like that. Okay? Right. Okay, so for some reason this week to me, it wasn't lying down all the way straight. And it could have been because this is an ear-to-ear -ear lace front. It's not the closure, as you can see right there. Okay, so I just didn't feel like the size over here was laying right. Okay, so I have to put bobby pins and stuff in there, but it just wasn't laying smooth. But it has everything to do with just this part, you know, not having the combs and it being go ear to ear. Okay, so I took this wig and I had this black band put in there. Now I see what they mean about the bands and to make it adjust to your head. I see what that means. So she did this for me Friday, Friday? I think it was Friday or Saturday. Friday or Saturday. Okay, put this band in here even though it's still too big. But that's not the point. The point that I'm trying to make is this. I didn't know, okay, that this hair was already the way it should have been, guys. Okay, my sister flat ironed this hair for me um, one night. I think it was Saturday. She flat ironed this. And while she was flat ironing it, it was looking cute. It was looking really nice. I like the way it looked. Okay. She flat ironed it, making it look pretty. But at the same time, and this is where the secret sabotage come in. At the same time, she told me, that if she just cuts, okay, a track out, that it would lay smoothly, okay? This is what she said, y'all. Now, when I first put this wig on, even though I didn't like the way it was put on me by the first person, it still was intact. Nothing was cut out of it. Let me show y'all what my sister did. Because every time I put this wig on now, y'all, the track shows. <laughs> Look what she did, y'all. Because they're going to track right here. You can clearly see it. So now when I put the wig on, y'all, it's got a whole, no matter which way I comb it, and I can really only comb it one way, because I can't even comb this going to back. This is the track, though. You can see it. Clearly see it. Clearly. Put it on in the front like this. Because here's the lace. It's a closure. No, this is um, ear to ear. Sorry. But as soon as you turn it to the side, you can see that damn track. She basically fucked my wig up by cutting that track out. And that's what I mean by a secret sabotage. And my question is, why just why you ordered the same exact wig what was the point of destroying mine even though it's like this i'm gonna still wear this because it's all type of cute scarves hats bands all type of cute stuff to still jazz it up and cover up that track but it's just that if i wanted to wear it like i'm wearing this Without a band or a scarf or anything, I can't. Because she, she ruined the wig when she cut that track out. Okay? So, yeah. Just basic bullshit. Y'all, I mean, the hate be so real out here is just sad. And I still 
for the life of me, won't understand it because damn, girl, you got the same wig, okay? And when I have gotten all of my hair, all of the hair has come with the tracks obviously where they're supposed to be if you didn't made a whole wig. Whoever, whatever company make the wigs, I'm sure you're gonna make it look all together like you should. It's not gonna have a track showing. So, mm -hmm. secret sabotage. But why? Why? Can somebody tell me why y'all think, you know, um, that happened? I mean, I, I know why, you know. And it's obvious why. I don't even have to say it. But it's just sick. It's just sad to me. Like, why fuck up my wig? Why? You just got you one. The same one. Mm -hmm. it's, it's a damn shame. And this other topic is, you know, just basically like I was saying before, how people think, how dumb, how dumb people think <laughs> that everybody around them, okay, are dumb. Even though they clearly the dumb motherfuckers, though. They be thinking it's you, and they know you smart. They know you educated. They know you the one that done been to school and then did this and accomplished that. They know they ain't did it, but they know you did. But be so quick all the time to say you crazy. You know what, y'all? People been calling me crazy. Family members. Friends. Some of my male friends, I'm talking about female friends too, but some of my male friends too, I'm, I'm the crazy one. I'm the crazy one. You know what I find so odd? I wonder why I'm so motherfucking crazy. Why do I keep getting so blessed? Why is everything falling in place for this crazy woman? Hmm. Why am I still able to move it and shake it around and do what I need to do if I'm so crazy and I, I can't keep it together? See, I don't like that type shit. I don't like people like that. If you a dumb motherfucker, please don't try to make somebody else feel like you know you are stupid, okay? Don't do that. Don't do that. Because I'm going to call your ass out on it in one way or another. So, all I'm saying is this. For the people that think they can run game here, no matter how weak it is. And what really make y'all extra dumb is that y'all don't even see. I'm not falling for no stupid shit. There's too much going on out here. And family, I'm going to say this. Y'all know we have a immediate urgent situation with Uncle Macy. We gonna need to focus there because that's what's important. Ain't nothing else with nobody thinking in they little fucked up ass minds important to me at the end of the day. So for all you dummies out there, so quick to call me dumb or crazy, stop. Go get y'all accomplishments up. If y'all feel like y'all wanna retaliate, Go get y'all a channel. Start it. It's free. Come on. I welcome it. If you feel like you can be successful at it, let's do it. You know? A lot of motherfuckers just always talking. That's all they do. Talk. But when it's time to be about that action, motherfuckers gone. They disperse. With the fake ass, oh, if you need this. Oh, if you need that. Don't just say the shit. Come on. Let it be about that action, okay? Could it be about that action? Yeah. <laughs> oh, this is the number I've been waiting for. Hold on, y'all. God damn, because I'm having some issue. There it go. Oh, we this commercial then came on. Right on. I've been, okay. I've been needing this information because right now, guys, I'm having an issue with my Wi-Fi. The technicians are coming out um, 
Wednesday between 3 and 4 o'clock to fix it. And I have to tell this man, you know, uh, even though somebody's paying for it, for me, it's in somebody else's name, I have to tell him, um, you know, you need to also tell these people that you need your money. You're going to need to be compensated for the days you couldn't use it. You know, I'm a whole YouTuber. I need Wi-Fi. That's why I didn't upload, drop a video yesterday. And I ain't with that. Now you affecting my money. And I can't roll like that. So, yeah. But anyway, guys, I'm going to be done because today, today, today is the day that I'm going to be giving you all that very special surprise that I talked about um, a couple days ago, Friday, Saturday. Yeah. I wasn't able to put it together because I was having some family situations and um, that needed to be handled at that time, which is that video is coming too, okay? But yeah, um, you guys get that big surprise today. Uh, well, maybe in a couple days, because I'm, I'm going to have a couple videos now already ready to go because I wasn't able to upload, which is cool. But at the same time, it's not because I need to do this shit every day. I need my money. Okay. So, <laughs> with that being said, everybody, I'm going to end this video. I'll see y'all in the next one. Stay tuned.